Hi, my name is Alex, and today I'm going to review the Square Touchless Payment Reader. I'm also going to review the Square Platform. So, so far the reader is a nice device that has a place to insert a card in. I don't know what this is for because I never used it yet. I don't even know if inserting a card in there would work. Also, note that the reader has a standard micro uh, USB-C type connector. So sorry, um, that was my mistake. It's a micro USB-B uh, connector and not micro USB-C which makes it great to uh, to plug and charge because we have plenty of those cables lying around all the time because of cell phones that used to have that connector and now our cell phones are all USB-C type uh, and you can see there's a nice display here that tells you exactly how much battery you have left and it pairs to your cell phone using the Bluetooth technology, which makes it great. It's wireless. It fits easily in a pocket. I'm very happy with it, but the Square platform itself lacks one important feature that, in my opinion, it would be great to have. It lacks the API, which means that there's no way that I can tie uh, the, the Square system in my own system. There's no way that I can tie them all up together so that when I receive payment from a client, the bill updates um, in our system. And that is possible with other companies, other products, but that's not possible yet with Square. Um, so that makes it a little bit uh, less attractive, but still a great option for receiving uh, contactless payment so uh, you can receive debit payments under $100 without any problems and you can receive credit card payments uh, for any um, amount that you want so again like I said the square contactless payment uh, device is very great I'm very happy with it and I truly recommend it for anyone that needs um, payments, it's uh, I like it more than than the small square um, reader where you had to stripe to to put the stripe in and swap the card in uh, your cell phone. It was kind of uh, hard to get the swipe to work on the first attempt and it would make customer quite nervous this uh, this version of the contactless payment is way better and it usually works fine I had one or two hiccups uh, since the beginning of using this device where it wouldn't connect but usually it's because of charging issues or of the cell phone that needs rebooting so it's a, it's a great option I am very satisfied like this video please uh, comment and also please subscribe to this channel I'll be posting other product reviews I'm the type of guy that usually buys a lot of these things and I will keep posting uh, reviews every week thank you